Good morning and welcome to another edition of Midlife Rising. My name is Greg. It's in like I'm out in the woods again. Actually, I'm as ill prepared as possible. Um, found this place randomly, but took a light little walk or a mini hike up a hill called Knockin' Hill. Now, to find this place is kind of hard, it's right in the middle of a residential area. So, really want to be uh, very selective of what I film, albeit this is a public park, because there's so little parking here, I want to just make sure I film only public areas. So I'm going to keep my eye out and watch for places to go, um, and just go for it. Really I was just going to go sleep and chill out today, but it's way too beautiful for that. Just way too beautiful a day. Perfect temperature, about probably 14, 15 degrees, no humidity, sunny skies, and as tired as I am, as beat up as I am, and as much as I don't feel well, better for me to go out there and enjoy the beautiful nature as it is in the safest way possible. Get out and enjoy it, but not get yourself into any trouble in the process. That's what I'm attempting to do, and I hope you follow along and enjoy the vlog. Alrighty, take care. We'll see what kind of adventures we can find for ourselves. All right, take care. Bye. for a small peak like this but it's nice to get something down and uh, knock it off and uh, you know I wasn't planning on doing anything today I was planning on just chilling and uh, not doing anything tired and uh, didn't have any plans thank god that didn't happen met a nice person up top here for a little bit uh, thanks man good talking to you oh uh, man hopefully we'll combine for some ways and start uh, scoring some ways maybe by that time I'll learn how to barrel all right but uh on the process of it it's a good view See Mount Work and all my past conquests, Gate Hill, um, down there, Finlayson, the whole nine yards. Uh, this actually is a pretty bomb park, to be honest, but parking is very, very tough. So if you do come here, uh, the warning is parking is very tough. I'm going to go check around here because it may or may not be the true summit. I'm going to see what's, what's around here. Uh, this is what the exploration is. I never go on turn until I'm 100% sure. It's a beautiful park, though. Definitely, definitely. I wasn't planning on doing anything. Boy, did I get rewarded. Alrighty. We'll see you. We'll see you on the trail. On further analysis, that was not the highest peak. Um, the peak place I went to is obviously probably the best place to go, but it was not the highest on in the boundary. Uh, the highest part of the hill is actually on private property. No, I'm not going to go there. No, I'm not going to film it. 
You'll have to find that out. And no, I did not go up there, and nor would I even think about it. So, um, yeah, that's not the highest point. It's a beautiful point, and it is on park boundary. I would go there and just kiss your ideas of getting the true summit goodbye. Uh, it ain't gonna happen. Uh, so yeah, that's the summary on that. That's a beautiful high point, beautiful way to end it on there. So yeah, if you were thinking that was the summit, no, sorry, I apologize about that. That's not the summit. Okay, guys, hope you enjoyed this vlog. It's like, much as I like making it, it's an interesting park. Um, there are some views around here, especially on the northern part of the park. Uh, definitely are the park, you really need to pay attention and stay within the trail markings. Uh, the one high point it was, didn't appear to actually be the true summit. True summit looked like it was on private land, so uh, I obviously didn't go there. Um, well, there are beautiful views across this park. Um, there's also another little area in one of the parts of the trail, there's another knob, but it's all roped off. Did not go up there either. Uh, still a nice park, so worth it for me to enjoy. Would I go out of my way if I was visiting Victoria to come to this park and go on this hike? No. If i in the situation I am and I want to get some nature and see some nice views and kind of get away from it all without driving too far, then yeah. If I live in the Victoria area, then yes, it's worth visiting. It saves a lot of gas money and unique park. Parking is very hard to find. It is in a residential area around here, so I definitely would consult my all trails. Make sure you park legally. Make sure you don't block driveways and be sure you respect people, all right? Again, I uh, hope everything goes good. I hope you enjoyed this vlog as much as I like making it. And I'll uh, see you on the next one. Take care.